Hey guys, welcome to part two of the Colorado vlog from last August. In this one, we're heading back to the other side of the state for some important business. And I get to try a lot of new snacks and get to do more thrifting. So I hope you guys enjoy it and on to the video. Dino 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 Okay, I have to pause past me because I am just dying <laughs> laughing at my facial expression in that clip. Because it's like confusion. Then it almost looks like mild disgust. But then the thumbs up is <laughs> like apparently it was just confusion. Me going, like, is this good? Do I really like this? And it kind of hitting the oh yeah, this is pretty. <laughs> Good, and I just, I can't, my 
facial expression in that clip. I just can't. It's hilarious. Oh my goodness. <laughs> here to button and say the next clips are filmed at Monarch Crest. It is like this little store and stuff at the top of Monarch Pass and it's almost tradition at this point for my family to stop there whenever we go over Monarch Pass. We've been doing it since I was little and I have memories of me going in going to the little dyed rock section and digging through and picking some out to take home. I don't know what happened to most of those, honestly, but that's getting sidetracked. But it was like a kick back to childhood right there, visiting there again. I was so happy. And uh, you'll see a few items I got there. Most of them will appear in a haul video filmed on my old camera. But uh, one will not, and it's an eagle statue, and that stayed in Colorado with one of my family members who let us stay at their house. That was a gift to them because they love those type of statues, and they didn't have that one. So I saw it, and I was like, oh, it's going to be a thank you gift, and they loved it. So yeah, um, on with the video. Just got excited and wanted to add a little blurb here, I guess. Uh, 
strawberry cheesecake ice cream. Yeah. Yes. We got back to Canyon City yesterday. Um, we stopped outside of Telluride, and that's where I picked up those snacks. And Ridge, we stopped in Ridgeway to look at that thrift store. And let me think, Monarch Crest to get some stuff, which will be shown in a little haul in the vlog, I think. I'm not sure yet. But yeah, everything I got, I'll haul when I get home, too, if someone doesn't want to go through the whole vlog. So, yeah. So, we're in Colorado Springs, and we did some thrift store shopping after um, what we came down here to do, and uh, didn't find much. Well, that's half a lie. I saw some things, but I was afraid to get broken in the plane. Or there were um, these gorgeous pieces of furniture. I love them. They were beautiful and pretty reasonable for what they were, but no way to get back to me. <laughs> so, yeah. Right now, the only thing I found is a cute shirt, which I'll show you right about now. Okay, since the original video quality of me showing off this top is horrendous, especially the lighting, I figured I'd show it to you now. It allows you to see some of the details a bit better, and it allows me to tell you a story about this lovely top. So, we go back to Canyon City after getting our business done in Colorado Springs and we go to the laundromat to wash our clothes because we'd been there long enough we needed to do laundry and uh when that's done I end up not being able to find this thing for the life of me and 
my suitcase, among the clean clothes, no nowhere. I couldn't find it anywhere. So, I am left to safely assume it was either forgotten at the laundromat or someone saw it at the laundromat and took it for some unknown reason. People are weird. Well, obviously, it wouldn't be here in my hands if that had happened. What really happened was, somehow, it ended up in my grandpa's stuff. He didn't notice, failed to take notice of it when we got home, and when he unpacked his stuff, he shoved it in a random dresser drawer, and it stayed there for months until, I think it was sometime in February, when I ended up having to clean out said dresser to make room for my little cousin's crib in that room and what do I find? I find it this. The shirt that I was so upset about losing thinking it was lost to avoid in Colorado and it was shoved in his dresser drawer for months. Failed to make the connection that hey I might want it back. That man is a bit of airhead and a menace. And there is a truck hello. But yeah. That was fun. I also found one of my missing hoodies in his room. So yeah. clips I am fairly certain were filmed on the second to last day we were in Colorado and in these ones we were going from Canyon to Pueblo and after that I think Denver and I remember this day vividly because my grandpa was being a menace. I wanted to go to the Goodwill there and the Goodwill that I know is there is the one that is in the old Toys R Us building because, um, that's just how I remember it. It's over by the mall and near the Golden Corral. That's just how I have it memorized because the last time I was there was when I was a kid. I didn't know a street name. Well, we're trying to find it. We missed the street by one turn off. End up going down the wrong street and getting lost. And my luck, this is refusing to work properly wouldn't really load anything and we finally managed to find the ARC thrift store which was nice I love the ARC thrift store it's nice but then uh, we go back to trying to find a bill and we get lost like extra lost and my grandpa is one of those that does not like asking for directions. We finally convince him to stop and ask for directions. Did that help us? No, somehow we got even more lost and turned around and ended up um, at a car dealership where we asked for directions. 
and uh did that help no somehow we got even more lost and went out we passed the zoo that's in the complete other direction from the actual mall and uh by some miracle this thing finally loads and uh we we finally get heading to the right place we finally get to goodwill and it's a real nice goodwill i like it there but uh it was a journey yeah it was yeah it was look at this place but yeah <sighs> on to those clips
So, we got home at sometime after 1 in the morning because our flight from North Carolina was delayed due to rain and I didn't get to bed until like 3. So, I, I look pretty rough, but I slept like dead until the cat got me up. But yeah, that was our that was our trip to Colorado. I'm sure I'm gonna have to film some um, fill in clips like me explaining what's going on or a voiceover or something. But I will do that when I'm editing the footage. But right now I'm gonna relax and enjoy being home in my own bed, not in a hotel room with two three people not in the living room of family members with three people while I slept on an air mattress and had to roll off that and struggle to get up and then share a room with another family member in a huge bed that um and by huge I mean very tall that was very uncomfortable because it was like 99% box springs and like frame and 1% mattress to fit. Like, it was rock hard and I'm getting squeaked at. What? Did you miss me? Let's see, can I, can I find her? Noe! Okay, also over by the computer is stuff I have to still go through from the truck, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one, so bye guys.